So every year during the month of July, my town hosts a county fair, and it's actually a lot of fun. They get tons of good food, entertainment, and best of all, they have a ton of games. Most of the games they have are, eh, they're not great or anything, but they're pretty good. I mean, you got a pie eating contest, you got a horse race, you got this rhubarb throwing contest where you just, you just huck rhubarb as far as you can. Just, just real exciting stuff. But none of those games matter, because they are all blown out of the water by one simple game. This game being... Pig Wrestling. Pig Wrestling may be the greatest game ever created. I'm not even kidding. This game is amazing. It's where a group of four kids get thrown into an arena along with a massive 100 pound pig. Then, they get exactly one minute to try to catch the pig, put it in a bucket, and kiss it on the ass. It's absolute insanity. There will be kids flying around, slipping in the mud, getting trampled by the pig. It's absolutely hilarious to watch, and me and my friends try to watch it every year. Except, one year however, I couldn't watch it. And that's because, I was one of the kids thrown in the arena! So, rewind back to like 2010. My brother Reed and I were hanging out with some of my neighbors, and they had come up with the great idea that, hey, you know, we should do that pig wrestling thing this year. At first, everyone loved the idea, including me, and I just remember thinking, hell yeah, let's do it! I had done AAU wrestling ever since I was little, so I thought, well, what's the difference with a pig? Well, actually, believe it or not, it turns out there's a huge difference between the little kids I was wrestling and a 200 pound full grown pig. And poor little Ty didn't realize that until he was staring the pig right in the face. I remember just sitting in the center of the arena, knee deep in mud, thinking to myself, Oh, well, so this is how I die. And right as I thought that, the buzzer sounded, and they released the pig. <laughs> yeah, I'm out. I immediately bolted the other direction, thinking, screw this. I don't really feel like leaving on a stretcher. Meanwhile, my brother was thinking the exact opposite. He sprinted straight at the pig and tackled it from the side. The pig squealed as loud as possible, and me and my neighbors were shocked. We quickly ran over to the bucket and brought it to Reed, who at the time was dragging behind the pig like he was on water skis. We got as close as we could to him and lined the bucket up perfectly for him. He then stood his ground and swung the pig around into the bucket. We caught it. We caught the stupid pig. Reed then quickly bent over, kissed it on the ass, finishing the game, and... We won. We actually won. The announcer then came down and congratulated all of us and gave us our trophies, which, funny enough, I still have it to this day. In the end, everything was great. Until the pig hopped out, stabbed Reed and ate him. 